Hey, Chuck here again, and I'm pretty excited today because we had a delivery, and I know that the Craft and Ride bag that I've been waiting for for like months and months and months has finally showed up today. So I ordered a bag for the pint, I don't know, a long time ago, and they kept putting the delivery date off. So, um, so let me uh, go ahead and pop this box open. Let's take a look at the, the new bag for the pint from Craft and Ride. All right, so, so what'd they send? So, we got your hacking slip. I was able to pre-order this thing and um, it included shipping. So I pre-ordered this in August and I paid $99.99 a piece and ordered two of them. So I got two bags. Oh, no. I had to pay $15 in shipping, so I got two bags for $214.98. So they send a pack of stickers and stuff, always like those. And so we got the two bags here. So the bags are very uh, square looking. So let's uh, pop one of these open and, and take a look. All right, so the the bag comes in a um, like a fanny pack looking thing, um, nylon strap with a buckle on the back, so you can like whip this over your shoulder as a sling or something like that. I'm sure, um, and that looks similar to the bag that's for the the um, XR. So let's see if they did this. <laughs> Why, right? Why do they? Why do they put the the um, the craft and ride patch on Velcro? So anyway, so the bag looks very similar. Oh, it doesn't have uh, I think the straps on the inside. Um, I don't know exactly, but this has hooks for the XR. And it says Super Row on the on the end there. And for the pint, it doesn't say Super Row. It has a nice, um, actually a padded uh, mesh. Um, back right here, so this would be a pretty nice uh, fanny pack looks like so let me go ahead and, and pop this thing out and Let's do a test fit Get your silica gels All right, so here we go first look at the craft and ride Backpack so definitely a lot smaller than the, the XR. Um, let's just pop it in and see what we got going on here. Let's unzip this sucker. You know, the material seems a lot thinner than the XR, but we'll double check that in a minute. So let's get this pointed down a little bit. I want to be able to see. How can I see? I'll turn on my screen. Well, anyway, I'm sure it'll get it. Okay, so here's the back backpack. Um, not a whole lot to see here, but let's figure out orientation. So the wheel's got to go into this little divot right there. So let's get the, the pint and drop it into that little divot there. So already it's looking like it, uh, it fits pretty well. Let's go ahead and Give it a zip up. So, very nice. There you have it new pint backpack that's a nice pockets yeah so uh, watch the Jimmy Chang video he uh, reviewed this a long time ago not a long time ago he seemed to have gotten the very first one ever in existence and uh, yeah so looks looks like a pretty nice uh, setup so yeah let me just uh, pull out the XR version now so you can take a look at that one so the XR 
version is very similar. Oh, there we go. So I put my strap on the inside, but it came with these uh, little carabiner clips, which is kind of neat, but no padding on the back side of the bag. So this bag has padding, but no uh, clips. So there's a difference in the bags there. And so here we go. The um, bag for the XR seems to be a lot heavier um, material. So this is definitely more heavy duty and this is lighter. So it makes the bag overall lighter, but you can definitely uh, tell um, that the material is different. So let's get this one in here. And I think that, you know, pretty much a bag's a bag. And there's the mixer. Got the fender on this one. Oh, had the fender on the pint as well. Trying to go as fast as I can, but I don't want to scrape my knuckles. I got a little bit off here. You gotta make sure you get the corners of the the bag. There you go. So we have the XR and the pint and the uh, bags, and I think it's uh, you know this one you get the symbol or the logo for Super Row. This one actually says Super Row, so see, let's see what differences we have. So I think that it has the same pouches on the wheel side, two pouches, and that's it for the XR. I mean, you don't get anything else, but on the pint, you get this extra pocket on the end. And down here, I think what this is down on the end is uh, it just allows you to expand the end if you have like a... Um, I don't know, aftermarket uh, kick plate or uh, whatever foot pad that might be a little bit bigger. But cinch downs for the shoulders. So that's it. Um, what can I say? Um, awesome bags. I'm hoping that I'm going to be able to get through security with the pint. And uh, so uh, take it easy out there and uh, catch you on the next one. Thanks.